Hi, sweet friends, and welcome to my channel. So today I have for you a Home Depot haul. So I stopped in at Home Depot to return an item that I bought that I got the wrong thing. So I needed to really not return it, but to exchange it. So Texas is in an energy um, conservation type mode. So I want to do my part and They've asked us to set our conditioners at 78 and that's not probably going to happen. But I do have a few opportunities to help my air conditioner out some. And uh, so I, I, I found this window film and I want to apply this to some windows. I have a window in my bedroom that gets a lot, a lot of sunlight. So I want to add this. Most of my windows are pretty shaded, but for sure that one window can use some taming down. So I did purchase it in the black. I originally got it in mirror. I didn't realize that they had different shades and different um, problems that the different shades solve. So I returned it. This one helps block heat and glare, rejects up to 58% of the sun, and helps reduce fading to interior furnishings, blocks up to 99% of UV rays. It was $17.98. The mirror one was $29.98. So by taking it back and getting this one, I did save a little bit of money. This is three foot by six and a half foot worth of film. And like I say, I picked it up in the black. And also when I bought the mirror, I didn't realize that I needed a kit, an application kit to go with it. So I had already made two trips to Home Depot to get it. And um, so if you buy the film, you also need to pick up this. This was $9.48. It contains application solution, a low lint cloth, trim tool and a squeegee so i got that and it tells you on here the tools that you need so to pick up that kit but i didn't read i didn't realize it thought it was pill and stick and it does say on here it's it's peel and clean easy to install i just didn't know i needed a solution and all those things so i got that i want to work on that this one this weekend and uh, get that window taken care of the next thing i picked up is this anvil glass and tile scraper kit and um i like this this big one if you work in like a plant or somewhere where you know there's always a uh, painting going on this is a good way to scrape your windows to remove that overspray and you can get a lot done in a short while with that four inch blade on there or at least i believe it's four inch yes it's four inch wide so picked that up this was seven dollars and 97 cents and it came with the extra blade so that was a good buy Got that next with the new variant that we see that is coming out from this um, illness that has been spreading, but you know, uh, kind of went down and now we're seeing it, the cases pick back up. I did stop on the cleaning aisle and I picked up a few products that I just want to set back in case, in case I need them. And I started out with some Clorox disinfecting wipes. You get 75 wipes for $4.98. This is a safe on finished woods, granite, and stainless steel. It's crisp linen. I use these. I use them in my kitchen, but if if need be, I could use these to wipe down door handles. All, all the things. So I just want to have several of these in my long-term storage in case I need them. Next, I put this alcohol. I didn't put it. I bought it. I bought alcohol sanitizer spray by Zeb. It was $5.88. And 
I picked up a Lysol disinfectant spray for $5.77. So I just want to get ahead. I want to be prepared. I want to have things here at my house. Um, you know, water, toilet paper, some of that stuff, just in case we end up back where we were at a year and a half ago. I do not want to have to be in the mix trying to hunt and search and peck out all the things that I need. I just want to already have them. And items like this are good any day of the week, no matter if you know what's going on. So you can always use any of this type thing around your house. And so it's not going to go to waste no matter what the outcome is. I hope you're having a fantastic day. If you have enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below. Become part of my friends here on YouTube. And I will see each of you in my next video. Bye, guys.